Welcome to Entel Digital Programmer. You can create individual code plugs here. Alternatively, multiple code plugs at once using our wizard feature. Let's assume you have a customer with an existing CTCSS only analog radio system. They want to upgrade to Entel Digital, but don't need any more complexity. Let's use the wizard to create that system. On the first screen you get a few options. You can put a fleet name here, so this will be your customer's name. We'll use UHF. Uh, you can put in a reprotect password, and this is where you put in the number of radios in the fleet. For this fleet, let's say there's 40 DX482s and 10 DX485s. We're going to use analog and digital channels. We could configure for analog only if it's, for example, a marine application. We're going with a single channel zone. We only want one group because we're emulating CTCSS and we don't need individual calling. This is the RF channel pool screen. We're going to take the customer's existing simplex UHF channel and create two digital channels using both time slots and one analog channel for backwards compatibility with his existing radios. A default digital channel has been created for you. All you need to do now is input the customer's frequency data, etc. Clone the channel, change this channel to slot 2, and we have both digital channels created. We now add in the analog channel, again inputting the customer's channel data. OK, so as you can see, we've now got three channels ready to be programmed into the radios. This is the channel preset data, default transmit and receive addresses, and preset alias. You will notice the alias is suffixed with 010203, etc. If you want to change the prefix from CH to channel, for example, type the word channel here with a space afterwards. Alternatively, you can edit each channel preset alias individually by double-clicking on it and editing accordingly. Next we have the button allocation screen. Please note all common buttons will be configured the same on both display and non-display radios. OK, so we've created a fleet of 50 code plugs. Let's save the fleet, file, save fleet as, uh, test, save, close this, and now we're ready to program the radios. We'll cover that in another video. Should you require any further information, please contact us via web chat, email or telephone. Thank you.